God, I feel sick. Don't like this at all. This porcelain bitch is the worst kind of news. Can you chill for two secs? We go in, we talk, we leave. That's it. She emptied the place. Shit. Excellent. You have come. Thanks for meeting me. Of course, V. And I thank you. Before we discuss details, I feel I owe you an explanation. I must tell you why I changed my mind and wish to help. Weren't sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your Nobu killed your father, now... I knew. From the start. You knew? All the board members knew. Not one soul even slightly interested in the matter believed in the poisoning. Details were disparate, inconsistent. You knew, but didn't do a thing about it. Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? My father had flaws. I know this. I harbor no illusions about it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? The corporation. Family. Our family. I was to be its heart. To uphold life. Ensure continuity. Stability. Never to oppose it. Huh. Guess Yorinobu's instructions were a little different. Yorinobu raised his hand against our father. But he is an Arasaka. He is family. I do not expect you to understand. I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly. That it is difficult. Mm hmm He's your brother. It's been hard. It'll be hard. Let's say I get that. What changed your mind? We received a warning during the parade. Security protocols were violated. The first doubts sprouted then. They grew yet greater in your hideout, when my brother's assault group arrived not to rescue, but to kill. Yorinobu was just plain willing to sacrifice you. My father was right about my brother. He never cared for us. I was brought up to be the heart of the family. It is time for the Arasakas to listen to their heart. It will bring justice. Did you bring Soul Killer? As we agreed, you Finger would. Finger on the trigger. Don't say a word. Of course I didn't bring Soul Killer. Afraid we don't know each other that well. You prefer to keep your guard up. Understandable, but unnecessary. We are here because I know how to save your life. I can lead you to Mikoshi. Meaning? Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do, and one is very near. Where? Here in Night City, beneath Arasaka Tower. We ought to leave. Right now. Wanna leave? What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. This is gonna be a disaster. Sit. We have little time. Sure know how to prick up my ears. Go on. Talk. My brother 
You catch a whiff of that? Smells like shit. Careful not to step in it. He must be made to take responsibility for his deeds. Sounds like you want to avenge dead old dad. I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How you plan to do this? Yorinobu. Hanako-sama, soro-soro gojitaku ni omodori itadaite. Sugu ni sumu wa. Yorinobu will soon call a meeting of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death. I will get you into this meeting, and you will testify against my brother. Testify? Listen, mind if I'm straight with you? Help me get rid of Yorinobu. I will help you get rid of the construct. Don't like this at all. Sounds like you want to use and me. No. I simply offer you an opportunity. Not the first to try. But what if I am the last? You cannot take that chance. We're getting the fuck out of here. Are you well? Yeah, yeah, it's just dumb. You are bleeding. Fuck. It seems you are running out of time. Don't delay. Make your decision. Uh, I'll think it over. You could use some air, right now. to me. See what I'm getting at? Yeah, I get it. I don't like it one bit. I'm still going Come strong. Come on, face the facts. Pop some pseudo-endotrizine. Scooch and let me get behind the wheel. I'll get us to fucking Makoshi. Yeah? How exactly? Without that porcelain cunt's help, that's for damn sure. Don't stand a chance without help. Right about that. But that's why I'll bring Rogue. She's not rusted through just yet. Plus, she owes me. Maybe she'd have stuck her neck out for you half a century ago, but now, I don't see it. I'll convince her. After all, we know a thing or two about ops like this. We'll blast our way into Sokka Tower, just like we did back in the day. Then find the way inside Makoshi. It's our only chance. Hanako's office on the table. I'm sorry. Who's? Oh, cut the crap. She actually has power. Could be our ticket. Our ticket, huh? Okay. I see your angle. You think working with the corpo cunt is gonna sweeten the deal? Well, let me tell you something. The corpo kleptocracy is not an option. Rogue and I will handle this, just like we used to. Stop, you dickhead. What's your scheme? This is my body. I make the calls. Not this time. Uh, Johnny! Jesus, look at you. Can't even... Great, you check it out again? What? Am I? No, it's not what you think. Not yet. 
easy there. Don't move just yet. Vic? You're in pain, I know. Delirious when you arrived, so I had to dose you with beta haloperidol. But light oversensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. My head. Ah! Almost done, stabilizing the biochip. Oh, feels like... Someone's using your head as a knife block? How... How'd I get here? Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. Then, you shoved my patient at the time off the table. And demanded you be treated immediately. Delamant was your guardian angel. Huh? I, uh... Wasn't completely myself. Yeah, I know. And that's a bit worrying. Order a weaker poison next time. This ain't no joke, kid. As I see it, there won't be a next time. All right. That should be a little better. Try sitting up. Carefully. I'll try. I think I'm getting some feeling back. Ah! So slowly. Ah, another victory for the history books. Hmm. Looks like I can sit up all right, but I can tell you don't have good news. How much longer is this going to go on? You tell me. Looking at you, not long at all. Next attack, you won't be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? Yeah, I know. Thoughts on where to start? Jesus, again. Do I have to spell it out? It's in your hands, not mine, and not those of that thing in your head. Now, see that setup over there? Yeah. What about it? You'll find a last dose of pseudo-endotrizin there. A gift from Misty. Want to give in to the voices in your head? Go ahead. Take a puff. Go silent. Get out. Or find another way. End things on your own terms. Got a little present for me over there, too. Blockers. Manage to walk those few yards to the table. The rest will be up to you, and you alone. You heard him. We've got one last chance. I'm taking the wheel. Endotrizine, Rogue Sokka Tower. Only way this is gonna work. Give it a fucking rest, Johnny. It's my decision. And I gotta think about it. Need to stretch your noodle? noodle? Fine. Fine. Just not, it's not in this basement. basement. V. Christ, you're talking out loud. Out loud? What? Just go fix this thing. Uh, think I can do it. Whatever you decide, let's make sure to get out of here first. Thank you enough for all you've done, Vic. Only wish I could have done more. Go on now. I want to close up. Take the meds and do what you gotta do, V. Thanks, Vic. I will. And you hang in there, too. Good luck, kid.
Hey V, I heard. Well, your thoughts? Shouldn't have had to. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on. And I know it won't be easy for either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Sure, lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Jackie? What's he got to do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. Top floor. He had the same glum face. Who, Jack? This is it, Chica. I'm done for. Doesn't sound like the Jackie I knew. That was a long time ago. ago. His mom mom just jumped out of the house and stepped up about Valentino. Trust, Trust me. Trust me. Trust me. Senora Rolls has one shoulder. Your gang is on the other. other. Another 
I know. Exactly why we'll do one last thing. Okay. Lost me. Realize the shit we've been through to get this far. Sure do. To let it all go now. Why? The cleanest, least bloody option. We try anything else, people will die. People die. It's the way of things. Am I worth their sacrifice? Are you? Besides, it's the only way we'll both be aware. Of what? Death? Mm -hmm. The moment life escapes. Never really gave it a thought. Funny how you still manage to surprise me sometimes. Might be something I learned from you. V, you sure about this? As long as you got nothing against it. Not how I'd have done it. But that's all right. Just like that. No pushback. Huh. Might have learned a little something from you, too. Is it time? You know, it really is beautiful. Been nice working with you, V. Yeah. With you too, Johnny. No fucking point. I mean, he... Do it. You'll see. It'll help. Sylvie, how's the real afterlife looking? It is nice as they say. Cause down here, it's still shit. Hell, might even be worse than before. Wish I had done more. So things might have come out different. Positive energy, Victor. I... Amen. And accept her into your fellowship of saints. Amen. May you rest in peace, be. Hey, V. I was thinking about you the other day, and I thought I just... Why? 
give you a call. I know it's pointless, but once upon a time, people were talking to graves and nobody batted an eyelid, right? When I said I was thinking about you, I meant a lot about everything you did. And I guess I get it. <clears throat> Why you wanted to leave this place once and for all. But st still, Z. Did you even think about, you know, what happens when... Shit, I can't do this! Hey V. Just wanted to tell you. I really hope there is an afterlife. Wanna know why? Hmm? Because that means one day we'll see each other again. And I'm gonna make you wish you never met me. What were you thinking, huh? Or did you think about nothing at all? Is that it? And after everything I did for you, Everything! And what's the first thing you go do, huh? Off yourself, that's what. If there is a hell, I hope you're in it. Rotting, burning, all of it. Bye. B. I heard what happened. You thought this would solve everything, didn't you? That this would adequately convey what you thought of this shitty world. Huh? That's something that always pissed me off, you know? This whole romanticizing suicide bullshit. Like we're all Romeo and Juliet. Cause you're so fucking original, aren't you? The only thing you proved is that you don't give a fuck about your friends. Am I right? Fucking waste. Suicidal. Well, guess it wasn't that far fetched. At least, that's how half the people in Night City end up anyway. Especially the good ones. Jamie Sheen, my first partner back on the force, blew his brains out. Didn't leave a note or anything. I knew it was because of how the top brass were handling things. Of course, not like it changed much. Except the fact we were down one more decent badge. Anyway, hope you're in a better place, V. message, but there are more things in heaven and earth than are dreamt of in my philosophy, right? I mean, in the end, in the end it was your choice, your choice to make. But, well, you should know it, it didn't just affect you, it hit your friends, too. I don't think... I don't think you knew just how many friends you really had. Maybe we'll see each other again, V. You, me, Jackie. Until then, take care. to pay the price.